God bless you, Prince of Peace. Uh, I want to greet both our in-house community, those that every week, um, they're, they're, they're here with us. Uh, they're really the, the life of this, of this church. And secondly, I want to greet all of our online family. Uh, I'm praying for you today and um, I'm, I'm coming to you because, first of all, we live in just some interesting times. Uh, it's some very, very interesting times and by interesting, you know, I'm speaking about the, the COVID-19 or better known as the coronavirus uh, that, is, that is really not just affecting the city of Buffalo but it's a, or, or affecting Western New York, um, but it's affecting uh, our nation and affecting our world. For that reason, uh, I, I believe it's important for us to know that as sons, daughters of God, we are not moved by fear, we are moved by faith. That's why we don't panic, that's why we don't lose our minds, uh, we don't lose our peace, because our peace, our faith, is all in Jesus Christ. And so, uh, because of everything that has happened, uh, we believe God, but we've also taken some precautions here at our church. Uh, that is why, first of all, we've, we've uh, met with our, our cleaning team here, our maintenance team here at the church. Uh, they have done an incredible job so far, uh, but we also want to tackle some more details. And for that reason, uh, we're focusing on disinfecting uh, both our chapel, also uh, taking a closer look at our children's area to make sure that both our children, our adults, and our seniors are all uh, safe and they can remain healthy. Uh, for that reason, it brings me to my second point, which if you don't feel well, if you feel like your immune system is already compromised, if you feel uh, uh, like big crowds, it's just, it, it's gonna compromise your immune system or you already feel some symptoms, we ask you to remain connected with us from home. Uh, we don't want you to come and, and, and just uh, feel, you know, that fear or anything like that. We want to remain in faith, uh, but we also want to stay aware of what's going on and be safe. And so, uh, for that reason, third and most important, remain connected with your church. Remain connected with us here at Prince of Peace. How can you do it? If you have not done so already, you can go on our, on our Facebook page, follow us. You can go on Instagram, follow us there. Uh, our YouTube page, follow us there. Uh, there are, these are three different uh, platforms that you can remain connected with us. We're gonna be here, I'm gonna be here Sunday. 9.30 a.m. is our English service. 11.30 a.m. is our Spanish service. And uh, we were gonna bring together the services, but we wanna keep crowds, uh, we wanna keep the crowd amount low. Uh, and for that reason, uh, we've remained connected to what our uh, county officials, our, their suggestions are, are bringing out. Uh, also our mayor and the city suggestions are uh, in, in being able to maintain a safe environment uh, for our members and for uh, the community of faith here. And we want to remain safe for the city of Buffalo. Uh, so please remain connected with us. Sunday, if there's two people here, uh, or if it's just me and the cameras on here on Sunday, I'm gonna preach the Word of God. Uh, I'm gonna preach until Jesus comes back. That's my mandate, that's my assignment. And so for that reason, remain connected with us. We're gonna be streaming live on Facebook, live on YouTube. So uh, you have uh, two opportunities to watch us live on Sunday morning. You can watch from home or you can come here to the sanctuary if you don't feel any symptoms. If, if you feel comfortable, you can still come. Uh, I'm praying for you. Remember, our hope is in Jesus Christ. I pray the peace of God be with you, be with your family, uh, and that you would walk in faith. Don't walk in fear. That's what I'm gonna preach about on Sunday morning. So God bless you. I'm praying for your family, and I'll, I'll see you soon. God bless you guys.